Hello, hello everybody. Welcome to another daily vlog. I am happy to be here with you guys today. It is already 1230. <laughs> I don't know where the mornings are going. Um, they just go by like that. Um, the kids had the day not really off of school. It's technically virtual learning. So Lucy had a little bit of schoolwork. I haven't even been able to get in contact with Nate's teacher to find out if he has anything. So Maybe I'll try to check on that today. He doesn't have his Chromebook, so it's kind of hard to log in for him because I don't even know everything to log in. Um, but we're having a pretty good day. I am about to venture out. The grass and everything is still covered in snow, but the roads are clear. Even our driveway is clear. So the temperatures are starting to warm up and they are... Um, you know, clearing off that. I don't think it's dangerous to drive. I'm going out because we have zero, <laughs> zero <laughs> milk and produce. So I told you guys my meal plan a couple of vlogs ago. I'm keeping it very simple. So basically I need milk. I need some more pepperoni for Lucy. I need veggies and fruit. And really that is it to make it through groceries this week. So, um, Anyway, I'm venturing out. I think I'm just going to go to Walmart. That way I can just get a, get it and get out. Um, I guess I could go to Aldi, but I just think I'm going to go to Walmart. Just Walmart is so much more convenient to run in, run out, um, and kind of get in the parking lot and everything's safer. safer. I think the roads are fine, but just to be on the safe side, I think I'm just going to go to Walmart. Um, we are doing really well. <sighs> with everything. I just want to say again, thank you guys for all of your support. I've gotten so many messages and comments and love and everything. And I just want to say thank you so much. I really appreciate it. We are, um, we're just kind of in like this groundhog day right now where my days are all mixed up. <laughs> I'm like, is it Monday? Today is Monday for us. Ah, it's just weird. But anyway, I'm going to go to the store. I thought about trying to walk around today. I just don't feel like it. So I'm just going to take it easy and not to try to stress about going on a walk right now um, and try to get back as quick as I can. Lucy still has piano today, so I need to get her ready for that. And I don't know if I'll take her or David or take her, but it's just in a few hours. So I don't want to be gone too long. I'm just going to run and get what I need at Walmart. I'll definitely show you guys when I get back. Um, and there's really nothing else to report. Um, I love you guys. That's really it. So I'm going to go run and get these groceries and I'll see you guys when I get home. Just want to let you guys know, I made it safe and sound to Walmart. The roads are perfectly fine, like not even a little bit slick or anything. So that's great news. We got so much snow yesterday, like more snow than we've had since we moved here, probably 10 to 12 inches of snow and it came so fast but thankfully the crews were out plowing the roads and all of that um and i think it's been made a lot big difference and also the warmer temperatures i mean it's only like 35 degrees right now so it's still really cold but um at least it's safe to get out so that is good news i'm hoping that means school will be back tomorrow this is the first time in like a week that I'm actually, or maybe not quite that. I actually did my hair and makeup today. I'm still in like jeans and a t-shirt, but I did my hair and makeup just to feel a little bit more nor normal, make it feel a little bit, make myself feel a little bit better. I mean, we're not going anywhere today really, except I'm going to go to Walmart. Um, we're going to be at home with the kids, but sometimes just getting up and getting ready just makes you feel a little bit more put together. Um, I also wanted to tell you guys, I have started a Patreon page with everything that's going on in our family right now. I'm trying to think of like creative ways to add a little extra income into our um, budget and everything. And YouTube just doesn't pay a lot. And so I don't want anyone to feel pressure at all, at all, if you don't want to join my Patreon. But I have like made a few different tiers. We'll talk about it later in the video. Um, if you want to support me on Patreon, basically you can pick a membership level. And with those different membership levels, um, you'll get extra content and extra like, we'll, we'll do some extra fun stuff together that I don't do just on my regular YouTube page. It gives me a little bit more freedom to be creative. So that will be linked down below and we'll go into more detail later on in the video. I'm really excited about it excited about it. I think that it'll be a fun new creative outlet for me and maybe add a little extra income right now um, when things are kind of stressful and give me something new to do and have fun with. So definitely check it out. Let me get, know what you guys think. Again, no pressure. 
at all if you can't or don't want to or any of that. Um, I'm just trying to think of new ways that I can stay at home and be with my kids and yet provide more, a little bit more for our family. So anyway, that will be linked down below. I'm going to run into Walmart, get our groceries, and I'll see y'all back at home. All right, everybody. I did my shopping and I'm home. I just really tried to get the bare necessities. Like I said, we have a ton of food in the house. So um, I did go into Kroger. They didn't have really anything that we want I thought was a good deal or whatever. So went to Walmart. I spent less than $20, like $19 and some change. So I think I got a lot for my money. Um, I went ahead and got two gallons of milk because we'll need that for the week. Um, baby carrots, green beans, some pepperoni, bananas, blueberries, and a bag of gala apples. Um, I think the, I think strawberries, at least on the ad, the preview ad I saw, it looks like strawberries are going to be, Mark is sad because he's getting out of an early bath. Um, I think strawberries are going to be on sale at Kroger starting on Wednesday. So if they are, I will definitely go and get some strawberries and whatever else looks like a really good bargain at Kroger. But this should be more than enough to get us through with fresh fruits and veggies until next week. So here's my little tiny mini haul. All right, we just had a knock on the door and it, where the kids are so excited. So my sweet friend, Sarah, Lucy's book is still not here yet. Um, it's, a, basically, it's, a little magazine. It's, not it's like a graphic novel, right? Well, they had, no, it's a chapter book because I read it to you. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Sarah let the kids, will you let Layla in? Sarah let the kids each pick out a book and it literally, she emailed me like the day we found out pretty much about all the stuff with the job. It was like a God thing. It was such a sweet thing. So the kids each got to pick out a book. Lucy's book is not here yet, but it's coming. So we'll show you guys when that, that comes. But Mark, his, one of his favorite things are these little blue truck books and he does not have good night, which I think is his all time have, favorite. He only, has, he only has the regular little blue truck. Yes. Yeah, that's the only one. He has. And good night is one of his favorites. He watches it on YouTube all the time. And then Nate picked out, of course, okay. big Nate revenge of the cream puff. So we're going to go in here and give it to Nate, which is perfect on the snowy day. Nate, you got a surprise in the mail. You got a surprise. Here, put that down for a second. Ready for your surprise? Look. <gasps> what is it? It's it's what? Is it a big Nate book? Yay. Can you say house? <laughs> Nate, can you say thank you to Miss Sarah? Say thank you. Thank you, Miss Sarah. Aw. You don't have that one, do you? You can add it to your collection. He's got many, many big Nate books over here. Well, these, these are aren't even all of them. There's a bunch in his bed too. And obviously we have not made up beds this morning, but. These are, these are the only one great ones he has. I think he likes it. <laughs> He's running off with it. <laughs> all right, Mark just woke up. Marky, you got a surprise. No, no. Look, he's not in the best mood, y'all. <gasps> Do you love it? Book. Yeah, do you want it? Peanut. Say thank you, Miss Sarah. That's so sweet. Peanut. Do you love it? <laughs> That's your favorite, huh? Peanut. Good night. That's right, buddy. Peanut. Little blue truck. You like it? Uh, wow, it. You love it. Give it a hug. Oh, Aww. <laughs> maybe daddy can read it to you. Okay. <laughs> it's perfect. Oh, <laughs> hello guys. Okay. Nate had my camera at one point today and I'm pretty sure he's the one that keeps zooming it in. So I start the vlog and I'm like, hi guys. <laughs> Sorry y'all. Um, let's see. I went to the grocery store, came home. I've literally done nothing for like days now, you know, and there's like trauma. It's hard for me. It's hard to like get back into normal life because you're just like, who cares about the laundry? Who cares about the dishes? You know, we've had this horrible stress in our life. Um, but like we are seriously okay. I cannot tell you the amount of support my family has gotten from family, from other uh, 
ministry people in our life, um, other churches. Like we have had so much support. It like it's hard to feel scared when you have so many people praying and you have so much support and you have so much love. Um, we just feel so blessed and we know that God's hand is on us. And so I feel like every day we're getting a little bit better. Um, and of course the enemy likes to come in and be like, well, what about this? What about that? What about this? I'm really trying not to do the, what about this? (laughs) Not let my mind go there. Like, oh my gosh, like, oh, I can't think right now about the possible moves that are in our move that's in our future. Um, I can't think right now about kids school and all. I just, we're doing one step at a time. So, um, we're really doing okay. I am still having really bad ear pain. I'm I guess I'm going to have to go to the doctor if it doesn't stop. It felt fine all morning, but now it's starting to hurt again. And I mean, I don't even know the last time I had an ear infection. I have no idea. Um, Probably when I was like a kid, but my ear hurts so bad and I've had a lot of congestion and stuff. And so it's possible I could be getting an ear infection just from, I guess, the fluid and stuff. But I don't want to go to the doctor because it's another expense and, you know, but if it still hurts, I'm going to have to go. Um, and let them look at it, but I keep thinking maybe it'll go away. (laughs) So I just took some Motrin. I'm sitting outside of Lucy's piano practice. Um, the roads were perfectly clear. She offered to do it virtually, but I thought, you know, it'd be good for her to be back in, you know, person. Um, we only had one practice before this year, you know, last week was her first week. And so she's back this week and then next week and, you know, every week after, (laughs) but, um, I thought it'd be good for her to just be in person and, you know, connect with her. Lucy's doing really well. She is the one that knows more than the boys. I mean, Nate doesn't really know much, um, about it. I'm trying not to stress, cause any stress to him. Um, we'll probably tell him on like need to know basis, basis, um, Lucy, we've explained a little bit more about the situation and what's coming. She's handling it like a, like a just a rock star. I mean, I she is so mature for her age, and she's been so strong. Um, I know this is scary for her. I know, like, I remember one time when I never moved as a kid, and I remember one time my parents were talking, just talking about the possibility of maybe moving, and it would mean, like, us having to change schools, and I remember just feeling so scared. My kids have had to do it a few times, and so, not that it gets easier, but at least she kind of knows, like, the world doesn't fall apart, you know, you, you, you're okay, Um, and so I've just tried to reassure her. But anyway, everything's going to be fine. Um, I'm not going to just keep talking about this on the vlog because I feel like there's nothing much to report. But when there is, I will definitely let you guys know. We're going to try to get back into somewhat of a normal life. Um, David is such a hard worker. He has been sending his resume and talking to people. And he, like, he's such a hard worker. He's, like, treating this whole season as, like, a full-time job, you know. Um, So I'm going to let him do that. I'm going to get back into, you know, trying to organize my house a little bit. That was kind of the mission I was on last week, which is organizing stuff. I'm going to keep doing that. I'm going to try to start saving us as much money as I can using up ingredients and food that we already have um, and see how far I can stretch that. God's going to take care of our big needs, um, but I want to do my part like as best I can. And um, when I get home tonight, we're going to sit down and talk about the Patreon thing because I don't want I don't want to just stress anyone out. I just want it to be a fun thing if you want to do it. Um, There's going to be some like bonus content and stuff like that. So we'll talk about that when I'm at home in front of the computer. Um, But anyway, I'm going to sit here at Lucy's uh, piano practice until she gets done. We're going to go home and I'm making chicken pot pie for dinner, which is so easy. I actually have a recipe of it and I will link that down below with the timestamp because it's like a casserole. If you guys need a good easy set of casseroles. I have a casserole video on here that I don't think got the love it deserved because like every single recipe on this video, not to toot my own horn, but every single recipe on this video are like delicious and easy. Um, So I will link it down below and I'll put the timestamp of the chicken pot pie, but you really should just watch the whole thing because they are so good. Um, It's so funny. Like it sometimes recipe videos get, I don't, I stopped making a lot of them because they don't get the views. Um, And then sometimes like certain ones of them do. So it's just random. Um, 
but <laughs> anyway, there is a really good, if you need some casserole, I feel like this time of year where it's cold and busy, casseroles are like perfect. They make a lot of leftovers. So I will link that video in this vlog. So I'm going to go home and make um, chicken pot pie that also makes a lot of food and you will have a lot of leftovers. It's huge. Um, so we're going to do that. And then we're just going to kind of hang out. The snow is really starting to melt more. So I have a feeling, um, that school will be back on tomorrow. We drove all the way across town. Like all the roads seem completely fine there. The, even the grassy areas are starting to melt a lot more. So anyway, I love you guys so much. I, I don't know what I would do without, like, I don't have, a, I have a few close friends, um, but you guys are like my support group, my friends and you and my family. Like, I don't know what I would do without being able to talk to you guys and all of your love and support. I couldn't get over all the comments on yesterday's video. Like, I just, I was blown away by the love and support. So thank you guys. And um, I'll see you guys back at home. All right, you guys, is it zoomed in again? <laughs> No, it's not. He has not touched it. Okay, so I came home from Lucy's practice and I made dinner. That is such an easy recipe. I got home at five o'clock and we were still like eating dinner at like six. So that was awesome. Um, and we have a bunch of leftovers in the fridge, so that's perfect. Anyway, I sat, I'm sitting down here in front of my Patreon because I kind of want to break everything down and tell you guys what you will get if you sign up for my Patreon. Again, I cannot stress this enough. If you financially can't do this, I feel like I can't talk. If you financially can't do this or don't want to do this, there is no pressure. My regular videos will still be up on YouTube, but this is just a bonus if you want to. Um, like I said, I'm trying to get creative. Right now with everything being crazy, we have some time, you know, and I thought this would be a good way to earn a little extra money and also do new things for you guys. So there's three different tiers, what we're, what I'm calling the bronze, silver, and then gold tier, and there are different amounts a month. So for the $3 amount, that's the bronze tier, $3 a month, um, you will get access to a bonus weekly video. This could be anything. It could be a recipe. It could be an organizational thing. It could be, it could literally be a chat. It could be anything. It will probably vary. So you will get access to see a bonus video, which I'm really excited about creating. Um, and that will go up on Patreon and it'll be a link to an unlisted video and you'll be able to see a new video for me that only the Patreon members will get to see. And then the other thing you will get is I will give you a shout out once a month. I will name all of my bronze members and give you a big thank you on my channel. So only $3 a month, you get four extra videos a month and you get um, a shout out. Uh, then moving on to the silver tier, you'll get both of those things I already said, and it just kind of builds on that, on that. So you do get access to both of those. You get a bonus video, and then um, you get a shout out recognizing that you're a silver member. Bonus though, for the silver tier, you will get access to a private live chat for just my silver and gold tier. So it'll be fun. It'll be at least once a month. It may be more often than that, where we'll just talk just us. So it'll be less people. We'll get interact, interact a little bit more. And then the other cool thing, you will get to vote in a monthly poll and you'll get to influence a future Bless Chess video. So I will poll you guys. You'll get to kind of help me pick a video to do, which will be a lot of fun. So if you want to have some influence on the videos I do, of course, I'm doing vlogs, but it'll be something within a vlog, maybe a taste test. So you could vote for that or you could vote for, you know, there'll be different options and then you'll have a chance to vote on that. So Silver tier is awesome because you get the bonus of the live chat for only $5 a month. And then if you really, really are just an amazing supporter <laughs> and you want to, um, the $10 a month tier is what I'm calling the gold tier. And you get everything that I already said. You get the bonus video. You get the private live chat. But you are also going to get an invitation to a monthly Zoom chat where we can actually see each other's faces and chat for a little while. I'm really looking forward to this because I really like to see you guys face to face and it would be impossible to do it except, 
not in such a, you know, a smaller group will be way easier than obviously like a, bit, a bunch of people in a Zoom call. So you'll get to have an invitation to a private Zoom chat, not a private Zoom call. It'll be all with all the gold team members that can be there. Um, and we will talk about like a good time. I'll try to make it sometime that's good for me and good for you guys, or at least the majority of you. And then you also, instead of just a monthly shout out, you will get a weekly shout out. So I will once a week give everybody that's a gold tier member a shout out. Um, I'm still trying to play around with this. So if there's something that you would like that's not included in any of these things, let me know. Maybe I could play around with it still, but I think this is a good way to start. I'm just easing into Patreon. I've still got to figure it out, but if you're interested, there's a link to my Patreon page down below. You just click on that and then click on membership. You, be, you should be able to see all these different things listed out. No pressure, but if you want to, it'll be fun. So you can read through and kind of see which one you might be interested in, and I'm really looking forward to it um, because this support will help me be able to make, keep making YouTube videos. Um, I do not get a lot of money from YouTube. I pay a lot of stuff out of pocket just to make YouTube videos, all the equipment. I mean, I really don't get paid a lot. And with my husband's job loss and all of this that we're going through right now, I don't want the quality of the Blush Just videos to suffer. I want to keep going. So if you feel so inclined, I would appreciate it. Yes. All right, sorry, you guys, Lucy left her cup in here. She was coming to get it. Kids are already laying down. I'm coming in here to finish editing. Um, I really just appreciate you guys. Like I said, I think I've said thank you a hundred times, but it's never going to be enough for all of your support. Like, I knew you guys would be supportive. Like, without a doubt, I knew you would. But the level of prayers and kindness, it just completely blew me away and, and me and David away. So we really appreciate it. Today's been a really good day. Um, David's had a really good couple of phone calls with some of his um, ministry support team, <laughs> crisis team members. And um, we really, everybody's praying and we really just feel a good peace about all of this. Um but anyway, that is going to be it for today. I did hear back, or actually we didn't hear anything from the school. So I'm assuming school is returning tomorrow. Um, they didn't say it would be canceled. So I'm sure it's going to be returning. So we're, we've been used to like sleeping in a little bit. It's going to be a rude awakening to start getting up early again. So I'm going to try to go to bed a little bit early. Um, but we've had a really, we've had a really nice time this weekend, just being together, um, it's a possibility we could be getting more snow Tuesday and Wednesday. Um, I don't know. I think right now it looks like we are going to be kind of south of where the majority of the like accumulation is going to hit. But of course, they never know. Like we weren't supposed to get this on Sunday. Uh, we got like 10 to 12 inches. So um, we'll see. <laughs> Stay tuned. I am still making daily videos. So if you are not subscribed, just hit that big red subscribe button and that will allow me to come to you. Like I like to say, instead of you having to go search for me or just wait for me to pop up on YouTube, um, you'll be able to go to your subscription feed and see me there. Every single morning at seven o'clock Eastern Standard Time is when my videos go up, but occasionally I may throw a bonus one in there. Also, if I ever go live, which I am planning on doing once a week, but that time will vary a little bit. Um, <clears throat> you should be able to see that in your feed as well. And then if you have notifications on the little bell, you click that and that will notify you if I go live and also when I post a new video every day. So anyway, I love you guys so much. If you like these vlogs, you want them to keep coming, make sure you give the video a big thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below. Subscribe if you're new. We'll see y'all tomorrow.